Little is known of Judy Bocher's date of birth, but the reggae and R&B singer was born in St. Vincent and the Grenadines, and migrated to Wickham, England in the mid-60s where she began singing alongside her brother in the popular dance band Judy Jace and the Beanstalks. Her music career took off in 1970 when the band performed around the southeast of England until Bocher retired from singing to raise a family. She was enticed back into the business by her friend Felix da Silva. Da Silva arranged a recording session with Sonny Roberts. He wrote and produced Bocher's debut song Dreaming of a Little Island. It was a hit on the reggae chart in 1985, and Jamaica's tourist board used it to promote the island. Later, Bocher follow up with Lovely Paradise. Even though the release did not make a big impression on the charts, Roberts was encouraged by the commercial success of Bocher's recordings and produced Can't Be With You Tonight in 1987. Lizzie Webb, a TV exercise queen at the time heard Can't Be With You Tonight while driving home. She decided to use it as her exercise tune, and the UK public began inquiring about it. The single crossed over to mainstream and the number one spot during midweek, but then remained at number two in the UK for four weeks. It also charted across Europe, including Ireland, France, Greece, Spain, and also the Philippines. The single is probably her best known song and really transformed her career. With this single, she became the first female from the Caribbean to have the longest stay in the national chart, with 14 weeks. Bocher followed with You Caught My Eyes, which was an equally successful top 20 hit but marked the end of her brush with international fame. Next, there was Whatever Will Be, Will Be, K. Sarah, Sarah, inspired by Nora Dean's earlier interpretation of the song. The song secured a comfortable position on the reggae charts and was followed by the equally popular Stick Around. Bocher continues to maintain a high profile in the big people's chart with her brand of easy listening lovers rock. She said that her Belgian tour was one of the highlights of her career, where she performed in front of 40,000 people. They chanted her name, holding lit candles as she sang. Bocher was also a massive hit in South Africa where she visited, but was unable to perform due to the boycott at the time. She was also asked to tour Swaziland, Namibia, the Seychelles, and several other African countries. According to Celebrity Net Worth, Bocher Net Worth is at $1 million. Bocher now resides in Bekwe, the second largest island in the Grenadines. Bocher is not only a talented reggae and R&B artist, she is also an ambassador for St. Vincent and the Grenadines. We wish Bocher continued success with her career. If you've listened this far give us a thumbs up. Please like share and subscribe to get notifications when we upload another one of our Caribbean Entertainer profile.